All right, hey, and welcome back to Inside. Uh, if I didn't tag this at the end of the final episode. Uh, so, in between when I played it and now, I've went back and gotten all of the disco ball things. And now I may potentially be on the cusp of the secret ending. Though at the moment I haven't... I didn't collect them all in one run, I've just collected them by like loading states over and over again. But maybe that'll work, I have no idea get to this the final one and that billboard in the back signifies all of the uh, all the disco ball orb things throughout the entire game and was very helpful in figuring out which ones I had missed uh, so yeah this is the final one and it looks like it's open so I guess I can do something Second one's active. Okay. So, what that most likely means, here is the uh, chapter select. So, the second one was the most like, holy crap, this is there kind of one, because it's in this cornfield. And I'm like, I, what? Are you kidding me? There's one here? Because uh, it's impossible to see. This It is Im literally impossible to see. But I was, like, holding X throughout this entire area. And then, yeah, right here, there's a hatch. And you climb down into this cellar thing. And the actual disco ball orb is over here. This is where the orb is for here. And there's a bunch of weird pictures and stuff. But then... Oh, that light's on. That wasn't on before. This is like playing a musical note. I don't know what this is. Okay, welcome back. So, I had a theory, an uh, epiphany, that by this E1 there's a recording, and that recording is what sounds like the door code. I am unsure if I got this door code correct. I have listened to it for a little bit, just to see. But uh, hopefully I got close enough that I can tweak what I wrote. Because I listened to it and I just, I put like big note, medium note, small note. So, hopefully. The best sequence I got was like small, medium, 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 big, big. Small, medium, 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 big, big. That's the best, like, section of notes I got. Oh, I went too far. That's small, that's medium, that's big. So, okay. How about...
Hmm. What about small, 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 medium, 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 big, big, big? Okay, so, big, big, medium, small, medium, 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 big, big, medium, small, small, big, big, medium, small, medium, 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 big, big, medium, small, 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 big, big. I think that's it. Holy shit, I got it. <laughs> oh my god. Didn't even have to look it up. I am still recording. Yes, I am. Okay, cool. Is storming outside, making this even more ominous. Like outside real life, not outside in the game. It still makes it ominous. Ooh. Disco ball things. And that looks like a mind control helmet attached to the yellow wires? Oh, and the kid shut down. The kid was being mind controlled. But by who? Or what? It's just a black screen. And it's inside. And it's loading. Is that the secret ending? Really? Uh... Nothing different... It seems. 
All of these are still the same. Um, is it just going to just start over? I guess the ending would be, hey, the kid's being mind controlled by something because of all you shut off all the mind control caps. I guess. That's a thing. I'm unsure if it changes anything in the actual game, though. I don't think it does, which is interesting. Um. Hmm. Okay, let's let's skip around. I'll give you a secondary thing. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba, I'll show you, give you the vague ideas. There's a mind control thing at this checkpoint. Mind control thing at this checkpoint. Obviously, I showed you that one. Mind control thing at this checkpoint. Uh, da -da 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 -da. mind control thing technically at that check at this checkpoint. This checkpoint, not the other one. Mind control thing at this checkpoint. Uh, not now I'm just now I'm forgetting I'm giving you a rough estimation I just went and did a bunch of them but I already had a bunch already taken care of that I think I showed off in the video like whatever you've seen in the series so far those are probably the ones I'm forgetting uh, mind control thing at this checkpoint mind control thing at this checkpoint Requires you to go back across the water in the submarine. Uh, there's a mind control thing. It, technically in one of these two checkpoints. It's in this area. You have to use the guys for it. It's technically after this. After this you can find it. Uh, there's actually nothing in this whole explodey area, which is nice. There is... There is one at this checkpoint. I, yeah, at this checkpoint, I think. No, 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 at this checkpoint. It's at this checkpoint that you can see it, and then you have to get to this checkpoint and swim back in the water to actually get it. Uh, there's one at this checkpoint. I believe in the video series I was diving down to try and... Uh, open a door and I didn't see the second latch on that door. So, yeah. There's one at this checkpoint. When you get the other box up onto this floor, you have to push it all the way to the right side of the room and use it to press a button, which will get you in to where a mind control device thing is. Or a disco ball. I still don't know for sure if they're mind control devices, but that ending kind of cements it a little for me. Uh, there is one at this checkpoint uh, where you have to split this group of people and get up above the elevator. And then right here is the last one. Now, I may skip ahead. Eh, well, I guess I can go straight to the end after this. I want to see if it changes the ending ending. It probably doesn't. But I want to go look at the last one, see if... See what's up with that. Alright, now all the lights are off. closed. I wonder I wonder if it completely reset it once you got that ending. That's very possible. Oh, I actually can't get back. Okay. Time to skip forward a little bit. To win with the blob. Because this is the Blob's final escape. 
I'm wondering if there's anything more after this. Or if it just goes to credits. Could just go to credits, it's entirely possible. <laughs> Just stop again. Alright, I'm gonna assume that's... I don't really want to wait for credits. I'll wait. Okay, I'll wait for the credits. Hmm. Interesting. So the secret ending... He finds a mind control helmet with a bunch of the yellow wires going into it that connect up to the disco balls all throughout the game. Could the disco balls be mind control amplifiers? Because we saw that you can daisy chain mind control, but it does have an area of effect. So could those amplifiers that are strewn all throughout the game just be amplifiers to uh, the... Um, entire mind controlling like process and that whatever's doing the ultimate mind controlling which I've heard a theory that it's the blob itself doing the ultimate mind controlling and controlling the kid to come free it I've heard that theory mm, kind of holds water a little bit but then, why would the blob control the kid to turn off all the things oh yeah, they have completely reset Hmm. Hmm. The only way to get the secret ending is if you backtrack. So you can't... You legitimately cannot get the secret ending without having gone through the game. I guess you could technically... Get... Like, go through the game all in one go, getting all of the mind control balls, and then right when you get the last one, just load the second checkpoint and do that whole thing. But then it would just end right there. So I guess I guess you could call it a second ending, and it is definitely a secret, and it requires extra puzzle solving. That was kind of neat. that he almost falled when he pulled it over. And it does require extra puzzle solving, but... Like, you can't get it in one go. You can't do that and then continue. You have to load a checkpoint and go back and do it. So it's an alternate ending where you never see the blob. You never get merged with the blob. You just unplug it. And you as the kid, the faceless drone, who is being mind-controlled, just turn off. Game's over. Interesting. Interesting. Well, uh, thank you very much for watching this last little bit of Inside. This was, I recorded a lot, and it was a little longer than I uh, expected, so this is probably uh, going under the moniker of Inside Extras, which is true. It is extras. Um, yeah, I'm not going to show you... How to get all the disco balls because each of the disco balls has its own puzzle uh so those vagueish descriptions of where they are and if you watch the series you saw a couple of them that i got uh because i got over half of them on my first go so you know it's not the worst tutorial in the world and it would give my videos views but this is the end of Inside. I got the secret ending. I got all the achievements, because all the achievements are tied to the mind control balls. So, if you are really stuck on a mind control ball, go stare at the uh, achievements and their descriptions and their pictures. would definitely help you in figuring out where exactly the mind control ball is going to be. Uh, 
because it gives you very helpful hints. So, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you all next time. This is the end end of Inside. There's nothing real more to do, I don't think, so. See you all next time.